Game 6 of the NBA Finals. The Los Angeles Lakers are down two games to three with the opportunity to prove themselves to the league, their fans, and most importantly, themselves. It's a pivotal must-win battle against the Chicago Bulls. Which heroes will rise? The NBA playoffs start now. Hold on tight. It's game six of the NBA Finals. Both teams deserving, but only one will come away with the Larry O'Brien. In this game, we'll see the Chicago Bulls going up against the Los Angeles Lakers. Two NBA greats, Grant Hill and Steve Smith, our analysts tonight, with our reporter, Ali LaForce. I'm Brian Anderson. Ali, it's all yours. Thanks, B.A. I mean, Anthony Davis is shining with the Lakers. LeBron said, quote, there's a reason we wanted him here. He's a complete player. All he ever wanted was a chance. And now that he has it, we haven't seen the best of AD yet. He is just scratching the surface. Makes you excited, B.A. They make one heck of a tag team. Thanks, Allie. Taking a look at the Lakers, they're in survival mode. Can they escape to force a Game 7 on their home court? Well, I'll tell you what, B.A., it won't be easy. The rowdy fans here, eager to see the confetti fall from the rafters, but it all comes down to the individuals between those lines. And the Lakers starting five. At forward, it's the incredible duo of LeBron and A.D. Kobe Bryant is out there with Johnson, and it's O'Neal in at center, locking down the middle. And for the Bulls... Here we go. Tip-off goes to the Lakers. Now Johnson. There's the screen by Johnson. Here's James. Blocked! What defensive awareness from Derrick Rose had the shot well anticipated. No good off the back of the rim. You won't see him miss that one too many times. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. Out left to the wing. Shot from 16, and he hits the jumper for two. Just another day at the office. D. Rose knows when and where to get his points. Outside Johnson. Now, here is James. Tightly guarded, out of bounds, it'll go to the Bulls. A fantastic mobile one block. This one deserves another look. You know that block has him and his teammates all pumped up. That is what playoff basketball is all about. And so here is Chicago. About a minute into this first quarter. Rose can't connect. Here's O'Neal to the paint. Davis. And he gets that one. The contact there can't stop AD. His size helps him get to his shot. Rose against Johnson. Pass to Rodman. Just five on the clock. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Rose can't connect. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Come on, B.A. He sure can rise. Grant, that's as good as it gets. One of the best in the league. Johnson against Rose. Here he goes. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. So far this quarter, he's been out of sync and might be pressing right now. James passes to Johnson. Here's O'Neal. And again, it's the Lakers. And once you get the height advantage from there, no need to mess around. The Bulls have gone only one of five so far. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to stream together some shots to have any kind of chance. Rose against Johnson. Back to Jordan. From deep three-point range. Rebound, Anthony Davis. 
I know that he has the ability and confidence to sink that shot. <laughs> but better luck next time, maybe. You know what another option is? Just give the ball up. Let someone else make a play. Now here's Rose. Fades back. And that one's good. Derek is just exceptional in the paint. A gifted score amongst the trees. Pass to Davis. Back to James. Got a piece of it. Here's Pippen. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. And there's the screen. Rose against Johnson. Here's Pippen. Goes up from the block. And he gets the bucket. It's all knotted up. And obviously their goal right now is to feed him the ball and get him going. Because he's someone that you lean on at the offensive end. Establish him early. Now, here is James. And here's Bryant outside. Rodman with a rebound. Here's Pippen. Checked by Davis. With the step back. Rose outside. Chance there to take the lead, but a miss. Outside Johnson. Pass to James. There's the triple. That shot off the mark. Chicago's gone 0 for 3 from downtown. Johnson against Rose. And here's Jordan. There's a screen. Shot clock at 5. Back to Rose from outside the arc. No good on the shot. So the Lakers will take it the other way. James passes to Davis. Inside, here's Johnson. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Great pass. We talk about 80s guard-like skills. That includes his floor vision. Johnson against Rose. With his first shot attempt. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. Johnson finds James. Over Rose. And that one's good. James. Coming off the pick, LeBron, great composure. Knows what he wants, and that's the score. Pass to Rodman. Back to Rose. Shoots over Johnson. And there's another one for the Bulls. Derrick Rose can score in many different ways. He's very comfortable in this spot. Johnson passes to James. There's the screen by Johnson. To the middle. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from here for the Lakers. They've gotten a lot of high-quality shots in the paint early on. That was clearly part of their game plan coming in. Another aspect of their game that's been super so far tonight is how they've been sharing the ball and piling up the assist. What's up? You know, it's been tremendous to watch Anthony Davis realize his potential here in the NBA. Over the seasons, he's lived up to the hype and developed himself into a true all-star. The Lakers in the lead. Here's West. He drops it from range. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Now here's DeRozan. Pass to Levine. DeRozan outside. 
pick by Vucevic. The three. And he buries his first look. That's good awareness from DeRozan. Spots the open man. That speaks to his all-around game. Here's West. Guarded by Rose. Shakes off strong D and gets to the bucket for two points. He's got five. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. DeRozan outside. Connects on the 17-footer. DeMar DeRozan's bread and butter. He has a great feel from the mid-range. And here's Westbrook from the arc. It's hauled in by the Bulls. To the inside. And DeRozan with the basket. On the assist by Levine. Now just a one-point Laker lead. The Lakers have got 8 of 15 shots to go. Pass to Davis. Down low. Here's Westbrook. And finished off by Westbrook. Giving the crowd what they want. Westbrook leaps for the dunk with reckless abandon. Vucevic, a screen on Davis. DeRozan against Davis. Fade away. And Davis with the block. The combination of agility and reach makes AD a lethal defender. Capable of sending shots back from anywhere. Now here's Westbrook. And he banks in the layup. Now it's a five-point Los Angeles lead. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Over to the left wing. Rose, left side. Pass to Levine. Here's Butler. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Levine. I love it. Got the basketball used to pick. A high percentage shot for Jimmy Butler off pick and roll plays. Left side, Davis. Over to Rosen. Again, the Lakers. When you have space like he did there, you never go with the fadeaway jumper. He has to attack the rim next time. Rose, left side. He hits it. His fourth make in ten tries. It's hard to try to stop D. Rose. When he's committed to scoring, get out of his way. Pass to Davis. To the left side wing. Here's West. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. Anthony's checked in for the Lakers. Chicago has gone just one of six from the three-point line so far. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. Coach definitely wants to talk about their interior defense, which has not been impressive. It's a matter of want to. Helping out contesting shots. You have to want to make the effort.
Here's Vucevic. Pass to Butler. 143 left in the first. Rose outside. Shot clock at six. Vucevic finds DeRozan. Back to Vucevic. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Vucevic has got his second bucket on the night. Pass to Abdul Jabbar. DeRozan against Anthony. A minute nine left to play in the first. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. <laughs> An outstanding first quarter from the field. Chicago trailing here. Here's Rose. DeRozan with the ball. Over Anthony. And there's another one for the Bulls. Los Angeles has gone only one of four from three-point land. And here's Anthony. Pass to Worthy. Out to the right wing. Here's West. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. They should continue to ride the hot hand. Monk, he's checked in for Russell Westbrook. One shot. And for the Bulls, they're shooting 55%. An ideal start so far. They set the pick. DeRozan passes to Butler. Oh, he missed it. Making him one for two now. And that's okay. Even though you miss, you had the right guy taking the shot. Here's West. Butler covering. To the paint. Here's Abdul-Jabbar. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. And the Lakers lead by nine. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. And so it's Los Angeles. They have a nice nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. And it's all due to their ability to own the paint. They've been dominant down low. We'll be right back with you shortly. And welcome back to 2K Sports, everybody. This game six getting started. And from what we've seen from the Lakers, what's your take so far? Well, so far, they've got things rolling along nicely at the offensive end. This is exactly what you want to see if you're a coach. Your team starting fast and playing with confidence. The Bulls shooting a nice 50% for the game. On the wing, Levine. Rebounded by West. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. But you know, we always talk about this. Just changing the shot can be just as effective as blocking it, even though it's less spectacular. And for Los Angeles, here's West. They lead by the biggest margin of the game at nine. Block at four. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. Yep, that one's good. O'Neal's got six. More points coming from inside. In that respect, they've been the more aggressive team. Pass to Rodman. Inside. Here's Butler. Deflected! And it's out of bounds. Still Chicago's ball. Starting the second quarter, about a minute gone. Count it. 
Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Here's Worthy. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Pass to Rondo. Just five to shoot. To the middle. Here's Monk. The shot off that time. Some solid defense from Jordan. Here's Pippen. Closing in on two minutes played here in the second. There's a screen. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. The Lakers in the lead. Outside Monk. Pass to Bryant. The three is up. The shot, no good. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Jordan with it. Here's Pippen. Checked by Rondo. Here's Pippen. To the inside. Out to the right wing. Shot clock at three. Here's Jordan. And he wills that one in. Sinking it right through the back of the iron. Now just a five-point Laker lead. Bryant outside. To the left wing. Jordan against Monk. Inside. Here's Bryant. Sinks that one after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. Not just selling for something along the perimeter. Excellent job. Pass to Butler. Now here's Jordan. Monk covers. And it's blocked. Here's Worthy. Cash is in the first attempt of the game. And the Lakers lead by nine. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now. Pass to Jordan. Outside Butler. Takes it inside. And it's rejected. Here in the second quarter of action as we approach four minutes played. Now here's Bryant. Now Monk. Here's O'Neal. Pass to Bryant. From downtown. Offensive rebound. That shot is good by O'Neal. Back in the day, someone would have blocked him out, but times have changed. LeBron, he's checked in for the Lakers. Johnson comes in for Rondo. And here now, a list of the players who have had the hottest hand in the playoffs.
So it's Chicago now. They trail by 11. Jordan against Johnson. Fires it from 18. Jordan with the bucket. Jordan's got his third basket on the night right there. Oh, man. They have really heated up from mid-range. Butler against James. And it's blocked by Butler. Beautiful anticipation by Jimmy Butler. He sees the shot, and he's right there to block it. Pass to O'Neal. And it's flushed down. A nice jam. And sends it home with some passion. I think he's rubbing it in a little bit here. Hanging up there like that. Jordan finds Butler. Down low. Here's Pippen. Puts the move on. Good. And Butler gets the assist. Six points for him. Great floor awareness there by Jimmy Butler. Sensing one of his guys is open and gets it to him. Pass to Worthy. Bryant outside. The six-footer. Trained it for two points. O'Neal's got eight points in the quarter. He's given a great lift to this offense tonight. Very, very efficient. Jordan, the pass to Butler. Clock at six. Here's Pippen. Three-pointer, no good. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. And it's blocked by Butler. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Butler. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for the Lakers. Russell Westbrook comes in for Bryant. Here's Westbrook. They lead by 11. Largest margin of the game. Here's O'Neal. And rejected. Now Jordan. He has six. Outside Butler. Back to Jordan. Outside for Butler. Hits the trifecta. Butler's got five points. Quick reflexes pay off for Butler. He gets the shot up before the defense can react. James finds Johnson. Here's O'Neal. Nikola Vucevic is checked in for Chicago. Rose comes in for Jimmy Butler. Right side, Davis. Back to Johnson. And it's stolen by Rhodes. Pass to Pippen. Three-pointer. And again, it's Chicago with a three. Backing up that last three with another three. The defense has to stop giving them so many clean looks. To the paint. Here's Westbrook. That's in there. Davis with the assist. Davis has got his fourth assist with that last one. Johnson against Rose. Pass to Jordan. And here is Vucevic. Rebounded by LeBron. And they're doing strong work on the glass. A plus five advantage for them. Now here's Davis. It's James on the wing. Westbrook outside. Right side Davis. Down to five on the shot clock. And a miss there on the triple. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. They set a pick. Pass to Rodman. Now Jordan. Pounded by Westbrook. Jordan goes in. It's blocked. Outside Davis. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Those are the plays Davis is capable of making. Much more confident and stronger than what he was when he came into this league. 
DeRozan has checked in for Chicago. Levine comes in for Jordan. One shot. That free throw, good from Davis. Chicago has gone two of three from the three-point line in the second. Pass to DeRozan. It's tipped! Now here's Westbrook. Six points for him. Sinks the tray! Westbrook's got five points now this quarter. Shooting while in rhythm. Westbrook understands his strengths on offense and plays to them well. To stop the run, the shot's good. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Here's West. He's got 11. Westbrook outside. And he drives in. And there it is for him. Westbrook's got 11 points. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Rose outside. Picked by Vucevic. On the attack, Rose. Oh, there's a killer two-hand slam. That's what you love about him. Once he drives the basketball, he has the ability to finish with the dunk. Westbrook outside. And he's going for the lob. And Davis slams it home. You won't find a much better alley-oop partner. AD flying to the rim. Here's Levine for three. And again, it's Chicago with a three. Defensively, you have to tight up on him or suffer the consequences. Here's West, guarded by Rose. Page. Chicago grabs the miss. And here's Levine. Pass to Rose. Here's Pippen. Five on the clock. Over Anthony. And again, it's Chicago. And very few teams rely on mid-range jumpers nowadays. But that's been their preferred way of finding points. Davis with it. He's got 12. There's a minute 34 left in the second. Pass to Westbrook. Davis with a screen on Levine. Westbrook can't hit. Chicago has gone three of four from outside so far in the second quarter. Rose outside. Throws it up high. Trying to go for a lob there. Excellent defense and anticipation to stop it. Here's West. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Chicago trailing here. Left side, Levine. And again, it's Chicago. In the mid-range area, the big vertical helps Zach Levine get a clean look, no matter who's around. Here's West. Back to Westbrook. Outside, Davis. Back to West. Anthony outside. Six on the shot clock. And they pick up two. Davis has got 14. I love the assertive play from Anthony Davis so far. Refusing to back down on the offensive end. Here's Rose. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Levine. Levine's got three assists now in this one. Three seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Westbrook with a screen on Rose. Here's West. Guarded by Rose. Rose. Back to Anthony. Oh, sinks it after the cagey pump fake. Nice. And the Lakers lead by eight. Not just swinging the ball around the perimeter. Aggressive move inside. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers with a six-point lead at the close of the quarter. What has them in front right now, by and large, they're taking great shots.
All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Thanks a lot. I'm with Frank Vogel and Coach. What's going to be critical in the second half to get this win? Yeah, it'll just be us. Okay? We've got to go on the free point line, keep off the free throw line, make them make contested twos. We've got to move the basketball offensively. Your expectations are always high defensively. Thank you, Coach. Thanks, Allie. After the break, we'll see you right back here to begin quarter number three. Hello, basketball fans. Halfway through this game six, and so far it's been a good one for the Los Angeles Lakers. The bench scoring has been a big key for them. They came in with energy, and they were able to give the starters a real break because of the way they perform. That's the kind of production every team hopes to have from their second unit. Seeing how things are shaking down for the Lakers. It seemed like this would be their series to lose, and that's surprisingly where it stands. Kenny, your thoughts? You want to win a championship? You have to make the bigger plays down the stretch. This is the biggest game of the season for them, and if they win tonight, it forces game seven, and that's needed. The leadership has to be there the entire second half. Really not a lot of room for error. If so, you're going to Hawaii, baby. Ooh, that sounds like a good idea. But not for them. That's going to do it for us right now. Will there be a Game 7? This second half should be a good one. And the energy is palpable in this arena. Welcome back to the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. A fantastic game from Anthony Davis in this one. He's been dominating down low. Gotta assume they'll keep feeding him the rock. Why go away from something that's working? Force the defense to prove that they can stop it. And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. Here's Pippen. 13 points in the game. Here's Jordan. Excellent D there from Bryant. I mean, you won't see this too often. Getting denied at the rim. He's likely to remember that one. And for Los Angeles, at forward, it's the incredible duo of LeBron and AD. Johnson is out there with Kobe Bryant. And it's O'Neal in at the center position. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Now here's Rose. 14 points for him. Fader on the way. And there's Jordan on the assist from Rose. Jordan's got eight points. Nice pass by Derrick Rose. Spotting the wide open guy from the corner of his eye. There's the screen by Johnson. Here's James. And again, it's the Lakers. Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. They set the pick. Pass to Rodman. Here's Rose. Shoots over Johnson. Again, the ball score. In the D, having issues slowing down their mid-range game. James passes to Davis. To the middle. Here's Johnson. Blocks! And it's out of bounds. The Lakers able to retain possession here. And now let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Here's Bryant inside, covered by Jordan. Shoots a fadeaway. Basket counts. And the Lakers lead by eight. They have no answer defensively inside. Rose against Johnson. Pass to Rodman. Now here's Jordan. Now Rose. 
He's got 16. And the shot's good. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last 10 points coming off assist. Johnson passes to James. There's the screen by Johnson. James outside. Davis a screen. Takes a 13-footer. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. The Bulls have gotten three or four shots to fall so far in the third. Pass to Jordan. Here's Rose. With the 10-footer. And again, it's Chicago. Each possession, more confidence from Derrick Rose. He wants the basketball. He's starting to knock him down. Johnson passes to James. Post it goes. James has gotten four this quarter. The indestructible one. LeBron brushing off contact with the easy deuce. Rose outside. Oh, and Bryant with a block. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Bryant. Butler's checked in for Chicago. gone about three and a half minutes here into the third five to shoot 13 feet out and he nails the jumper Butler's got seven this is one of Jimmy Butler's go-to's he loves the jump shot from mid-range pass to O'Neal back to Johnson the three drills it from deep Johnson's gotten his second bucket. Right now, he's being too passive and not looking for a shot enough. He needs to be more aggressive and get more shots up because he's shooting well. Now here's Rose. 20 points for him. Butler with the ball. Now here's Jordan. Outside Butler. Misses the three. Used the pump fake well, but he couldn't capitalize. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. A shot by Johnson, no good. And <laughs> just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. Pass to Jordan. There's a screen. Sinks that one from the post. Jordan's got four points now in the quarter. When you use it right, the pump fakes as effective a move as there is. Now Bryant. Ooh, it's stolen by Jordan. Butler on the wing. Back to Jordan. Off target from three-point range. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Bryant outside. Here's O'Neal. That one's good. And the assist to Bryant. He's got 16. Man, he's been on point. Not forcing things. Getting the most of his looks within the flow. And there's a pick. Pass to Rodman. Back to Rose. And here's Jordan. There's the drive. And it's out of bounds. Still Chicago's ball. DeMar DeRozan's checked in for Chicago. Levine comes in for Jordan. And the Lakers also making a switch. Rondo, he's checked in for LeBron. Just five to shoot. From the baseline. And DeRozan gets it to go. On the assist by Butler. Butler's got three assists tonight. Outside Johnson. Over to the wing. Outside. Rondo. Fires from deep. 
The shot comes out, and the Bulls go on the other way now. And here is DeRozan. Give him eight points now. Rondo with the steal. Now the Lakers moving it up. Here's O'Neal. Book it. He's now 9 for 11 after that one. Rondo is out there to distribute the ball. He is a master at finding the open man. Rose, the pass to DeRozan. Levine against Johnson. Levine with it. He's got five. Six to shoot. It counts! And the foul! They'll pin that one on Rajon Rondo. In case anyone was wondering, this is what it looks like when you're in the zone. He hasn't missed one all quarter. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Lakers? The one Find thing the that stood out all game is one the shot. consistent penetration they've gotten. Their passing also continues to be outstanding here in the second half. The Bulls making a switch here. Vucevic is checked in. And that one falls for Rose. A fan favorite in this league. Rose's hard work and perseverance through injuries speaks volumes. to West. Anthony with it. Down low. Now here's Rondo. Guarded by Rose. Five on the clock. Ooh, coming through again. Shooting five for seven now. And he was dominant in their last outing. And the same thing here tonight. He is in a terrific groove right now. Here's the thing. He's a guy who will go on hot streaks for you over a number of games. They get the rebound. Hmm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. They have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. Here's Worthy. It's rebounded by Jimmy Butler. Outside Levine. And a great assist by Butler as that one goes. Butler's got his fourth assist with that last one. Pass to Abdul-Jabbar. Here's West. He's covered by Levine. Outside, Rondo. 
Here's Abdul Jamar. Gets himself open and drills it. So few players still use the hook shot, but it's a tremendous weapon when done right. The Rose and outside. Pass to Rose. Outside Levine. Back to Rose. Uneasy two on the layup. Rose has got 11 here in the quarter alone. Can't blame the deficit on him. He's been scoring at will this period. And here's Anthony, defended by DeRozan. Here's Worthy. And it's blocked by Butler. And they're able to recover. Pass to Rondo. Off target from outside. Chicago has gone 0 for 2 from outside here on the third. Here's Rose. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. Rose has got 13 in the second half. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Anthony outside. Here's Rondo. And it's good. Two points. And the strength of Rondo finishing through contact. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And as we head into this break, the players have an opportunity to replenish their energy with Gatorade as they prepare to go into the final stages of this ball game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, not to mention over the course of a season, you have to stay hydrated. If you don't, it's amazing how much slower your body is to bounce back. It can have a serious effect on performance, no question. Both teams deciding to change it up. Outside Levine. The Rosen outside. Six on the shot clock. Back to Levine. Over Westbrook. And Levine with the basket. On the assist by DeRozan. Levine's got four points this quarter. Now to me, this is where DeRozan has really developed. Able to make plays for his teammates. Anthony in the post. Defended by DeRozan. Yep, that one goes. We've got 123 left in the third quarter. Here's Pippen. He's got 13. Back to DeRozan. To the paint. And he drops in the layup off the glass. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Los Angeles has gone only one of four from three-point land in the third quarter. Pass to Anthony. 50 seconds left in the third. Here's Worthy. 
Just five on the clock. Here's West. No good from outside. He got his defender off his feet with a pump fake, but couldn't knock it down. Here's Levine. And again, it's Chicago. These defenders really need to man up, particularly in the lane. And we've got 28 seconds left to play in the third quarter of basketball. To the inside. And the basket by West. 15 points in the game. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Anthony against DeRozan. Let's it fly. And the Bulls tack on two more. You can really see their confidence growing as this game has gone on. They have reason to believe them. Yeah, the reason is they tied it up. But it took a lot of focus and a lot of energy. We'll see if they can sustain this effort. Derrick Rose has been leading the charge for the Chicago Bulls. His fingerprints were all over that quarter. 13 points, leading the charge. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. And a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Yeah, you also have the location of the pass. Puts it right where it needs to be, where his man can do something with it. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. Outside Johnson. Back to James. The bank shot, no good. Well, the Bulls shooting the ball at 60%, an excellent average. And for Los Angeles, at forward, it's the incredible duo of LeBron and AD. Kobe Bryant is out there with Johnson. And it's O'Neal in at the five, roaming the paint. Pass to Bryant. Over Butler. Bryant, no good. Bryant's gone two for six from the floor so far. Here's Pippen. Back to Jordan. Inside. To take the lead. Count it. And the foul. It's going to be on Anthony Davis. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. It's the fourth quarter and it's a close game. You want to get the ball to someone you can rely on. Rose has checked in for Butler. One shot. Lakers trail. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Davis a screen. Here's James. Ooh, a terrific shot on the turnaround. Effective in that mid-range area. LeBron can just rise above you and knock it down. Rose, the pass to Jordan. That one goes in. And the Bulls lead by three. Time and time again, they're creating good looks from close range. James, outside. And it's Chicago with the board. Here's Pippen. And there's the lob. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt. And here's Bryant outside. He buries it from three. The passing of LeBron is so special. So talented at finding his wide open teammates. Jordan with a screen on Johnson. Pass to Rodman. Jordan against Bryant. Knocked away. Stolen by Bryant. 
Outside Davis. The fadeaway. Doesn't go that time. So the Bulls will take it the other way. The battle of the boards has been something to watch. Out to the wing. Here's Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. And once he gets to the rim, it's fairly automatic. Nothing fancy right there. Just takes his two points. Moves on. Now here's Johnson. There's the screen by Johnson. Bryant outside. To the inside. That shot is good by O'Neal. O'Neal's got 20 points. Zero rim protection. Unforgivable in a tight ball game like this. And I love the play call. This is where you get the ball into the hands of your closers, where they can do something with it. Pippen, no good. For Los Angeles, they've gotten three of seven attempts in this fourth quarter to fall. Here's James. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make it a three-point play. Greatest players of all time. LeBron just continuing to add to his legacy. Here's the pick. Here's Jordan. The putback. It's good on the putback. I always love the hard work on the glass. Just great activity. Johnson passes to James. Now here's Davis. And he recovers it. Bryant outside. Davis with a screen on Jordan. Second shot opportunity. And Davis gets it to go on the assist by Bryant. Bryant's got five assists in the game. Pass to Rose. And he lobs it up top. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. Here's O'Neal, and it's good for two. And now a five-point Laker lead. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Bryant against Jordan. Back to Rose. To the middle. Hey, in six attempts, he's made five. Talk about efficiency. Taking it straight to the rim. Going for the high percentage shot when it matters the most. Coming down the stretch, you know this. You want to go to something that's bankable. That's as good as it gets. Johnson. A three. James. Rose grabs the board. His struggles from the field continue. Yet, they still hold the lead. And the basket is good. He got it to go, and he took the bump. So a free throw coming up, an opportunity at a three-point play. One shot. Angeles has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. There's the screen by Johnson. And he's going for the oop here. And Davis slams it home. Anthony Davis is showing us he's a shot maker in this league. He's the guy you want to get the ball to. Pass to Jordan. Lays it up and banks it in. It's winning time, and that's a winning play. The Lakers have gotten seven to go out of 13 attempts during the fourth. James outside, and it's James with.
with the jab. You can't allow LeBron to get into the lane because he's going to punish you for that mistake. Rose with it, and Johnson picks him up defensively. That puts him in the lead. Jordan's got 13 in the second half. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Now here's Johnson over Rose, and it's off the back of the rim. No good. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Pass to Rodman. Here's Pippen. Launches it. And again, it's Chicago with a three. That's exactly the kind of shooting you need down the stretch to win games. The Lakers have gotten 8 of 15 during the fourth quarter. James, outside. From deep, Johnson. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got four assists in the game. Jordan with a screen on Johnson. Here's Rose. Hits the front of the rim and out. Los Angeles has gone 2 of 4 from the perimeter here in the fourth quarter. The lob. Very well done. Neither team able to take a hold of this game. Yeah, it's been a tight one. Numerous lead changes, very competitive. Rose, the pass to Jordan. Fades and shoots. And again, it's Chicago. And from the mid-range area, they've been the more effective team. James, outside. Pass to Davis. Back to James. Down to five on the shot clock. Johnson finds James. Puts up a three. And the Lakers hit again from deep. After a lackluster first half, he's taken charge offensively. We'll see how the defense responds. Jordan with it. Covered by Bryant. 16 feet out. Jordan with the bucket. Jordan's got 23. Uh, stepping up in the big moment. I mean, an incredible job of finding his shot. Working the mid-range, but you would think the defense would be keying on him. Now here's Davis. Pass to Johnson. Takes a 13-footer. And there's another one for the Lakers. They're winning the battle down low by imposing their will. Rose, the pass to Jordan. And good work on the boards as they picked up the second chance points. 25 points in the game. Man, in a tight ball game, it's nice to have him on your team. He's giving them life in the fourth quarter, shooting seven for nine. Now here's Brian. Here's O'Neal. And it goes as the official calls the foul. Count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. And the Lakers making a change here. misses. Chicago has got six out of 15-3 so far in this game. Pass to Pippen. That one goes. And that's his ninth made shot in 12 attempts. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. Timeout called the Lakers. Boy, you look at Derrick Rose. What a contribution. And I think a new plan would be a good idea. At least make it hard on this guy.
All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Frank Vogel told the team earlier. He told them to be more careful about their selections, saying, quote, don't force it at the arc. If it's not a good look, don't risk it. Move the ball, attack inside. Use your options. All right, appreciate it, Allie. to James. And here's Davis. And finished off by Davis. Exceptional timing on the pick and roll. AD showing a good feel for how to generate points. Fades away. And misses it off the right side of the rim. And you know they were praying for that one to go down. They could have tied it up. That was a huge opportunity they missed. It seems like every miss ends up in his hands. He's been unreal. And we have to give him props. It's rare these days to see someone dominate the glass so single-handedly. Here's Pippen. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. Los Angeles has gone three of six from downtown so far in the fourth. Here's James. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. The defender gets caught in a bad position. LeBron powerful enough to convert through contact. Let's see what he does at the line. this lead. Rose outside. To the paint. Here's Jordan. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Rose. Rose has got nine assists in the game. Great passing. James attacking. Capitalizes off the crossover. James has got 21. With the elite handle, LeBron has defenders at his mercy. And he lobs it up to the rim. Oh, and Bryant with the block. And he recovers it. Jordan with the bucket. Now that's a confidence booster. Great effort on the offensive glass. You know what? That was perfect timing on that possession. Huge play in the game. They needed those points right now. Now here's James. Money. The defense has no answer for LeBron, allowing him to really run things on offense. Bulls making a switch here. Butler's checked in.
Now here's Rose. He's covered closely. Yes! Now that play was made by Derrick Rose because of his ability to play pick and roll basketball. James, outside. Down low. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. They trail by five. 26 seconds left in the fourth. Butler against Bryant. Now here's Butler. The D's right on him. No good from 11 feet. And so they foul intentionally. Drops the first one, and that increases the lead to six. And the second free throw, no good. Tough break there. Outside Butler, beyond the arc. Oh, he buried the three! Great way to create driving lanes, which is what Butler wants to do.
Seven seconds left in the fourth. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Yeah, and that was a smart move. I mean, you have to foul right there. You just don't want them to run out the clock. the first one and that gives him a four-point cushion and so both free throws good and it's a five-point game when you've got your opponent down don't let him up this one's all but over Pippen gets the three to fall good play call a good execution the offense running on all cylinders and so they choose to intentionally foul. Yeah, and there's no question they have to foul. Now, I'm sure they would have preferred to avoid it. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. Is good getting both at the line and it's a four-point ball game so it's a narrow victory for the Lakers pulling it out for the W they're able to force a winner take all game seven they stave off elimination and anyone can win this series now and really they answered the call tonight with their backs against the wall they fought with passion and their season continues well now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce Allie. LeBron, you got that perimeter shot falling as the game wore on. How'd you dial it in? Uh, I mean, I work on my shot every day. I work on my game every day, so it doesn't matter if I miss uh, all of them in the first, second, third. I still believe that I'm going to make the next one. All that hard work really paid off late. Congratulations. Allie, thank you as always. So game six, NBA Finals now complete, and the series is deadlocked and going to a game seven. For Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson. Thanks for joining us tonight. Now our New Balance Player of the Game.